Okay, I literally just, I have no idea what the hell just happened. Like, we're playing Pokemon, and then it started at 2.30. I went in, got the thing strapped to my head. The mask was so tight. Um, I did like, what? Well, I think they said it was 82 minutes at the start, and then I had 30 minutes left. Um, when I had a break and then the last 30 minutes took like two hours of me having to like not breathe basically because of the tolerances being like you know zero meals and stuff and if I moved at all just kept breaking it so I won't be taking a break again but the next two sessions are going to be shorter but like I literally have no idea what's going on right now I have no idea what was going on then Shane is just like driving normally and everything seems normal. But me, everything is so weird. I don't know, I like zapped cancer out of my head. Maybe there's just less cancer so everything seems a bit normal. I, I have, literally have no idea. Um, even time seems to be moving faster. I've been recording this video for a minute 20. Like it feels like it's been 20 seconds. Uh, that was the weirdest thing that's ever happened to me in my life, excluding getting cancer. Um, I feel so weird. Like. And the indents on your face are gone. You can post the photo. Of that I got a photo to post or something of indents on my face. Um, I had bubbles. I had bubbles. She said. Um, for some reason I've smoked like 10 cigarettes today. Not that many. Five. I don't know. Um, so I've got the weekend to re relax or something. I just don't feel right at all. I feel so weird. Oh my. I, I don't even like... I, I want to say something inspirational or educational, but I don't have anything to say. That's weird. They used uh, 192 laser beams to target your head at one time. Yeah, 192 laser beams at once. 192. Like. That's freaking cool. Oh. So I highly still recommend that everyone quit smoking. Don't get a job in the city, park in the shit. Yeah, wait till the metro tunnel and all that's finished. <laughs> Driving the shit. The traffic is absolutely shocking. Parking is absolutely shocking. Thanks, Shana. That was good. Um, I was trying to do something inspirational and educational. Some, get some MRIs done, people. You do not want to have to go through that. The mask is, is like so claustrophobic. I, I don't know. They said they're keeping it for Monday and Tuesday, but then I get it. And You'll have a Jason mask to frame. Yeah, it's like a Jason mask. Like, my breathing's all fucked, I don't know why. I feel like I've got my eyesight back, I might be able to play games later. With someone. Um, I, I literally have no idea what is happening still, right now. Except I'm going home, or I'm going to pick up, I'm going to pick up the kids they were in care um, this is this for me now is going to be so interesting to watch back like a few of these videos especially this one like oh my god I feel so whack Am I still supposed to be taking the dexamethasone? Yep. Because your brain will probably swell over the next few days. So brain's going to swell. Brain's, brain feels like it's swelling now, to be honest. Like, I don't know. I noticed I have this little patch of hair. I'm going to have to, like, shave some of it because I'm missing some hair. Uh, yeah, well... Yep. Thank you, everyone. 
like without everyone I, w I don't know what would be be happening so much support from everywhere two more sessions of that and then chemo and radiation therapy and then then I'll just be normal again right or something and I can go back to lecturing people telling everyone how I'm right you and how I'm a narcissist <laughs> yeah I, I don't know trying to make some jokes I'm not really jokey I just I don't know what the hell is going on <sighs> they said you feel disoriented disorientated yep yep whoever I see tonight I can't wait conversations about something the mask like the fucking mask I feel like Jim Carrey but no I just feel like Jim Carrey actually yeah <laughs> has a mask is mental is woke is knowledgeable is intelligent is comedic uh, was my favourite actor probably still is my favourite actor I literally have no idea what is going on driving home I said this like five times anyway I love everyone thank you thank you for being here on this journey this journey has been amazing but not but amazing because nobody wants to have cancer and go through a cancer journey but but I kind of think I did somebody needed to do all this and like I don't, I don't know if someone could do it it'd be me right I did and I am two more sessions of that mask on my head like oh my god